How goes the family? Welcome back to Letters Anything Goes. Hope you guys are having a great Sunday. Today's poem is going to be called End of the Year. Goodbye 2020. Adios poem. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Some hold lots of fear. Some are very, very happy and filled with cheer because we are all basically at the end of the year. Let's be crystal clear. Throw out all these things out of the window like hatred, excuses. Let 2020 be when you start a revolution. Throw in goals, execution, action, and do not try to include a New Year's resolution. Throw in LLCs, distribution, partnerships should be a part of our 2020 goal achieving family tree. When it comes to being surrounded by negativity, do your best to look at those items and try to eliminate. Those portions are detrimental to your physical and mental health. They can decide your faith. Next thing you know that you're once again a year late. In life, it's not always about what you think and fantasize about, but it's actually about what you've done so that with others, you can have some clout. Life gets to a point where one has to do more than just provide. Let's look at what you've done over the year and see how you can do better this year without nothing to hide. Don't forget to eliminate certain people who shouldn't have ever been a part of your life's ride. At the end of the day, it's your life. I just hope that whatever in 2020 you all decide, just don't end up like those idiots that used to digest Tide. Negative people on your heart, spirit, and life's place, so much weight. 2020, let's start off fresh out of the gate with the right people, high interest rate savings accounts, so that we can start out straight. I know that there are those people that will get a few days in and weeks in, then they say the heck with it and find a way to make their airtight goals start to leak. Excuses. I have no time for it. The game is on and excuses start to reek. All in around, then they reach their peak to how they are going to be. Then once again, time flies and here it comes again. Wonderful New Year's Eve. Yet again, you approach your goals with the same hope, with the same plan, not knowing where you're going to truly land. But you all will definitely know where in life you truly stand. 2020, let it be about family, friends, and definitely about getting assets and money. Then and only then can our days be less rainy and definitely more sunny. Stop with all this individualistic way of living. Become more immigrant-minded. Let this be a new way that we as a group can start living. Every family with your last name should have some sort of company that to their children they can leave. Then, after high school, your kids, 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 kids can finally financially breathe. With current generations, after high school, people are setting up their kids so that they can take an economic plea by only, and I mean only, just getting a college degree. With only that, it can only put them out there to the job getting C. In 2020 and beyond, I say to you all, now it's on. For you, I hope that you make the right choices and actions. To the excuses, losers, just do your best to make the ultimate subtractions. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the poem. Please like, definitely subscribe, share the videos. Remember, knowledge equals money, money equals assets, and assets equals freedom. In that order. Hopefully you guys have a great new year. Take care.